Link 2012. Okay. Emerald. Boom. Wither skeleton skull. Boom. Diamonds. I don't need that. I don't even know why I have that on me right now. So this is the Reluctant Topaz Longsword. It has sharpness 7, but it gives you less health and knockback resistance. Is it worth it? The question is, can I enchant it? So if I can put additional enchants on that... Oh... But it doesn't compensate for the legendary. Legendary is better. Okay, so this says, apparently this is what his divinity did to evolutionists. God's sense of humor. <laughs> so we turned him into monkeys. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Because uh, this, this map revolves around his divinity. Okay. That's interesting, then. So these are actually originally players. But they were turned into monkeys. I think we're good to go. Let's drink some more potions. Finish up looking at this area. And then dip our toes in the mansion. Oh, yes. I love my doggo. Taking down the skeletons. Oh, and look at how fast we are thanks to speed 2. Oh, this is so overpowered. What's in here? Oh, we, we need to go back and get that one chest. Yeah, I know. I guess we can... Oh, there's all these graves too. I hope we... Oh, we don't have a shovel on us. I bet there's stuff in each of... Uh, in most of them. I hope I put a, a hint, like a torch or something above it. Not exactly that, of course. Uh, night vision, and eh, we don't need that. More light, diamond helmet. Let's go ahead and take it for now. Is there anything in here? No, I doubt it. I always found this little fountain fascinating in the map. Because it never really did anything. It was just there, the dry fountain. It's a good touch. It's a really good touch. The, whoever built this map. Mithrina built this map, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Goodbye, crazy zombies. Okay, let's actually finish lighting this up before we take the chest. Just so that way we don't get any spooksters coming at us. Wonderful. Good. Good. Can't shoot them. I don't want them to explode. See, that's the issue with sulfur arrows. On one hand, yay, you can explode things. On the other hand, yay, no, it, it explodes things. <laughs> it's just an ordinary diamond sword and some regen. We'll take the regen for now because we'll probably need it soon. But this is the door I'm talking about. If you try to break into it, you can't. You can't get through it. Try to go around it. Nope, can't go through it. Oh, what about the grave? Ooh. Ooh! So if we do some grave robbing, we get... Oh, holy smokes! Truth versus reality and three medallions. Truth versus reality. What's the difference? How do they relate to each other? And why is it in this grave? Is this a grave or is this an altar? Let's chest say chest medallion of courage. This is a grave. I'm pretty sure it's a grave. I did not consider this to be an altar. So that's really nice. So now, so those are gonna be handy. Might want to put some of those away though, because they are very valuable. But let's do some more grave digging. How about here? Nope. Oh, so there's a spawner and a dropper in each grave. Oh, or just two droppers. Interesting. 
So we could go through and loot all those, theoretically. That's what we are going to do. Because you never know, because there's there might be something special in one of them. Something other than an XP bottle. But so far, it's only XP bottles. So experience and death. Or in the grave. In death. If only we could explode all these at once. Or if only we had a shovel. Let's just open all of them. We do have haste on right now, which does make this 20% faster. Oh, there's flowers around this one. So th I bet this is a special one. Nope. Apparently not. It's just another grave. All these have XP bottles in them. Looks like. But wait, we still have a few more. We have six more. Oh, this one's big. So I bet this one... It's got yeah, I knew there was some, I knew there was at least one. Oh yeah, we're gonna check that out in a second after we conquer all these the rest of these. Yeah, things are pretty laggy right now. Boom, XP, XP, yeah, these are just all gonna have XP in them except for that big one. And then I'm going to have to go put some stuff away. Because we, didn't, we don't have enough space. And we definitely don't want to keep these all three of these medallions on us. We only need one. Okay, so we got some XP bottles, just like in all the other graves. Except three instead of two. We got a book of looting three. That's really, really good, actually. And then we got some Soon TM leggings. These give you minus speed, but attack damage and knockback resistance. So you can get a total of... Oh, and you get extra for the boots because it's, you know, minus speed. And I'm not sure how the speed stacks. I'm pretty sure it's respective to each other. But you do have to hop around still. So you get 4, 5.2 attack damage. That's a lot. You'll be able to one-hit kill mobs in this thing. But at the same time, of course, you'll be very slow. And it's not 100% knockback resistance. Oh my, we really are out of room. <laughs> Let's go. I think, mm, I guess we can use our backpack here. Let's go ahead and grab the backpack. Don't need that. Come on. On my backpack. There you go. Sweet. And in the backpack, we're going to put goo. We're going to put medallions. This stuff. This. We have a lot of stuff we don't need. Right. Let's put all... <laughs> Man, another another example of this thing not working properly. It might also be the I can't I think batch could trigger it for some reason originally, and so I had to change that. I want things that can't stack, so like this. I am putting super valuable stuff in this, although I do keep my backpack in my under chest, so it's not as big of a deal. I'm really not going to keep... I really shouldn't keep ivory. Alright. Comebacks bow. Make brick smash humans. Put the comebacks bow in here. Your goals. And some enchanting books. Oops. 
Actually, we need three more spots for uh, the armor, so we're going to go ahead and do this. And then, we don't need instant health right now. We could use, we're, we are going to use stamina soon. Yeah, so a lot of these potions we technically don't need. Let's go ahead and swap these out. Wait, did we have a cheesy potion in here? No, we don't. Oops. I think at this point in time I realized, hey, cheesy potions, they take up a whole inventory space, so you really only use them, uh, you know, if you come across them. So I decided to make them extended, and now they're actually really good. The issues, of course, you know, you have to choose what you keep in your inventory, especially with those medallions. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this, yeah, I fixed the bug where it would only uh, give it to me if I didn't hit a mob. So that entire backpack book I wrote was useless. <laughs> or not too, use it's minimally useful. Okay. So technically, actually, if we ever want regeneration, oh, we don't have a beast. We don't have mermaid tears. God, I really should get mermaid tears. And I really should not be carrying sulfur tips around with me in the mansion, to be honest. Okay, I think we're good. We got medallion of courage. We got the fire admin diamond thing. Let's do this. Still have strength for four minutes. That's nice. Oh, we didn't even get this chest. Are all these... Boop. Wonderful. Boop. And a cheesy potion. Let's keep it for now. Throw it out if we don't need it in the end. Don't. Doesn't hurt. Except if we're in emergency. Perfect. Ooh, cool! A soggy splinter. Fire aspect for unbreaking level 25. So this won't break very easy. It's got some nice fire aspect. And it's plus 7 damage, meaning that it is the equivalent of a diamond sword. I think there was a, a, a sword similar to that in the original hack. Not with the fire aspect, but it was a, a wood sword, I think. Oh, we do get iron blocks. So we probably should... Oh, holy smokes. I forgot about these guys. The indecisive mages. So they blind you when they you hit them. They change their armor constantly. So you need to hit them at the right moment. And they smite you. So it's a fun combination. Oh, nuts. This is not a good spot to be in with these guys. No! No! Okay, now I'm in emergency. Oh, I'm definitely in emergency. I'm glad I had that panic potion. Or whatever that potion was. Oh, it was the Medallion of Courage that helped me out, too. Well, I don't have the Mermaid Tears. It was awful that I fell down there. Oh, boy. But great that I survived. That's really nice. Okay. So, whatever's over there... That air was primed to explode. Oh, I forgot. I removed the sulfur tips. You see, that was actually why I was trying to come out here, was to gather them up and then explode them all. It doesn't look like that's going to be the case. All right. I want to close this off. We can deal with one bit at a time. Okay, very good, very good. Oh, nice. There's, there's a squatter over here, isn't there? Okay, okay. Scout. A 
bad thing is that the dog won't attack these guys on default, only attack skeletons on default. Alright. Armor's doing okay. Go ahead and guard up here. What do we want? Oh, we would like some strength. Oh, we have a head. We have an indecisive mage head. Yeah, so you want to hit them when they're on the, uh, the, the phase. It's almost like in my, how in Minecraft, uh, 1.9 plus you have to wait to attack so you need to be sort of strategic with it Here it's similar you have to be strategic with your attacks in terms of uh, When you hit them Because sometimes they're weaker sometimes they're stronger And this will be nice once we when we unlock the basic exchange I'm pretty sure we can turn all these in for XP Which is great and the indecisive mage head is just an indecisive mage head. Nothing too spectacular about it. And it says let it be for their for their head. If only they knew that. <laughs> They're the ones who need that advice. Okay, so we still have haste. Let's drink a regen potion. Can use it. Now this is a little secret here. This one's pretty easy to find. Come down here and you get a wither skeleton skull. We really need that. And, uh, Aqua Infinity 1, Respiration 3, and what's this thing here? This thing is a storage crystal. Break it to see what's inside. You smash the storage crystal, and re it released an aroma, saturating the group for the next minute. So it has all sorts of different effects, like that. Sometimes it's not effects, sometimes it's uh, actual items. I was pretty proud of those. <laughs> With a skeleton skull, okay, let's make a safe spot. There we go. Perfect. No! Nope, Lassie! 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 No, get out of there! <gasps> They're almost dead. Do I have any meat? Take, take, take. No! Stop it! Don't die! No, Lassie, come over here! That's a bug I would fi I would need to fix, man. Okay, I think he needs some sort of antidote. Because he is not stopping right now, which is very scary. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Come over here. I have lots of meat for you. This is terrifying! Fire aspect 2 for the wizard wand. Alright, we're gonna go home, Lassie. You gotta get home. You gotta get home so you don't die. Oh, now he's lagging. That's nice. Ish. Is there anything... I don't think I have a, an antidote for that sort of thing, though. I don't have an antidote for Wither. Sure, I have an antidote for Poison, but Wither? Lassie, I didn't mean to kill you. No. Let's get home. He stopped! He's alive! Lassie! Alright. Alright, so this is the issue, is that if he falls off, he can die. So we do need to be careful around this area. Alright, let's get back to Recovered Haven, bro. Oh, that's scary, man. That's scary. But we're alive! Woohoo! Alright, let's go put our stuff away. And get some new stuff, of course. Soggy Splinter! Uh, I don't know. Let's go check out... What was it? There was another really nice sword. Ah, I put it away. 
Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh. Where are our pages? <laughs> I remember that part. Okay. Um. Emerald seeds, wand. Let's go ahead and put our wand in here. I'm glad we picked up that rotten flesh. I used a lot of meat on him, too. So I guess we need to be really careful around uh, that head. We should probably actually make Lassie sit, even though it would be helpful for us to have him. Hmm, should I put them in here? Let's go ahead and put them in here for now. Even though some of them aren't really sayings. Iron. Put it in here. XP bottles. We know where that goes. Let's get all the XP. We should actually keep a bit. Because we do want to buy all of the different medallions. There's like five. There's five, right? Yeah, there's five. It's a lot. We do have some extra though now, which is nice. Oh boy, I need to put all this away. Ugh, not fun. I want to check this out though. Where did we put sets in the end? Sets. And materials. Okay. This isn't technically a set. But I'm going to put it in here because we're low on storage space for armor. And it is supposed to be worn together. Because once you get two of these pieces, you might as well go all three. All four, I mean. Indecisive mage can go in there. Can I put fire aspect on us is the question. Or any sort of other thing. Oh, you can! Okay, so here's the question. Sharpness 5, 7. So sharpness 1 is, what is it, 1.25 attack damage or 1.5 attack damage? Meaning that you really reach 10, so it's not as good as this one at all. So we're going to keep this one. We're going to put fire aspect on it. Better have fire aspect in here. I think fire aspect's the rare one. Yeah, let's grab it. Wouldn't hurt to put looting on this either. Or sharpness five. Just put everything on it, right? You know? This will be the ultimate one of the ultimate swords. Do we not have Looting 3? I, I thought we got a Looting 3 book. It's Looting 2. Looting 3, right there. Okay. And I do realize that I'm doing this on a lot of levels that I could be using to enchant, but oh well. Alright, so this is an, a really, really good sword. The only better thing could be knockback, but I don't think we need it. I really don't think we should have knockback. Um, we already have knockback on our bow, so we can use that in the situations where we want knockback. Really don't need a lot of that. Goo-wise... We don't need diamonds. We need a beastly potion. And I can't remember what we need for the rest of them. We don't need that in there. We don't need that in there. Why is that even in there? We'll keep it in there for now. Okay. You know, in case we need healing. What else is in here? Oh my, we really need to take all this out. The heads need to go uh, somewhere else, though. So, so much goo. 
Right, so all the books, the these sorts of things come in here. And then we can take the rest of this out. Okay, so special items. This is definitely a special item. I'm going to put pendants and whatnot in here. Perfect. Big brick smash human, that's a keepsake. Okay, any other keepsakes in here? I guess we have goo, but that's more of a special item. All right. Put our backpack back in there. Your goals. Put that in here. Materials go in these chests. Can't wait to get the basic exchange. That's going to be really good. Once we get it. Oh, we still have looting three. Oh, I did grab a looting three book. I grab an extra one. Okay. Let's put that back in here. Oh, we don't want to put fire protection in there. Don't want to put punch in there either. Punch goes with bows, and fire protection goes with. My dog sounds like he's not doing too great. Oh, because he's sitting. Well, I don't want you to die, dog. I, I didn't know that you could get withered by that. So now you have to stay home all day till the next area. Even though I think they have exploding skeletons in this next area, which is very, 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 very scary. But I'm going to have to ride through it. Tasty. We do have our emergency potion. Good. We need... Oh, do we not have... Oh, please tell me we have more stamina. I don't think we have any more stamina. Yeah, we need to make more strength potions. Oh, we do need magma cream. So let's go ahead and see if we have any of that. No, we, do, we can make it, though. Let's go ahead and make some magma cream. Oh, one second. Let me pause this right here. <laughs> 